let's take a look at the student work of two of my students who were solving workshop problem number two. Find the smallest number that rounds to 400 when rounding to the nearest 100. Take a look at Trisha's work and Eli's work and think to yourself, whose work do you agree with? Who accurately identified the smallest number that rounds to 400 when rounding to the nearest 100? Take 30 seconds to think for yourself. When I say show, get ready to show me a T with your hands for Trisha or an E with your fingers for Eli. Get ready, show. Who do you agree with? Hmm, I'm seeing some T's and some E's. Let's talk about it. If you agree with Trisha, why do you agree with Trisha? Say it out loud. I heard friends say that they agree with Trisha because she identified a range of numbers that round to 400. She showed all the numbers that round down to 400 because she knows 450 and up rounds up to 500. So 449 must be the first number below 450 that rounds down. The range she came up with is 401 to 449. The smallest number within that range is 401. Hmm, what do you think? Let's take a look at Eli's. If you agree with Eli's work, why do you think his work is stronger? Go ahead and say it out loud. That's right, I can't trick you. Eli's work is stronger because Eli showed two number lines, one that shows all the numbers that round up to 400 and another number line that shows all the numbers that rounds down to 400. Eli remembered that we have to ask ourselves, what are the range of numbers that round to my given number and that numbers can round up or down. Trisha was on the right track, but she only thought about the numbers that were higher than 400 that would round back down to 400. Eli thought about the numbers that both round up and round down, so he had the complete range. Team, what do you want to remember about Eli's work that's going to help you be successful as you continue throughout yours? Go ahead and say it out loud. Yes, that's right. I heard friends say they're going to make sure they include the full range of numbers all the numbers that round up and down to their given number by using two number lines to show the numbers that round up and the numbers that round down. 